the good thing is I'm going to be opening a hundred, but then with all the crypto keys I'm going to be getting, I'm going to get like over a hundred. Now I'm only going to write down any like new epics that I get. One of the epic weapons that I get is the Olympia that I already have. These should be no dupes. I have six mail six ranged weapons in this game that I don't own, including the nail gun. And you're gonna give me something I already have? Really? head theme probably already have that I wish it would tell you if it was a dupe death blossom serif taunt epic I don't know if I have that Duplicate, so I didn't have that Seraph taunt. No Valhalla gem for the El Car Nine. Undertow, Nomad Henthe, Nomad, my favorite specialist in Black Ops 3. Don't know if that's a dupe. Doesn't tell you. Not impressed. I wish I could preview that. There's no preview, there's just a clip. Prontosaurus, decal. Don't care about decals. Goblin King Ruin Body Theme, I'm pretty sure I already have that. Hey. Top Secret Reticle. Interesting. Uh oh, Pistol Grip. Nice. A Quick Draw Variant. Vesper Camo Ritual. I'd like to get a ranged weapon that I don't have. Spitfire extended mag variant. Cool. I do like the weapon variants. I think they're interesting. They make the weapon look cool. Ritual for the Elkar 9. I don't remember much about the L car 9. 
Inferno BRM laser sight variant and solar firebreak body theme. I have to say the outfits in this game are way better than the outfits were in the beginning of Black Ops 4. They got way better towards the end. Dingo. It's like Dingo Dial in Crash Bandicoot. Drop shot reticle. What do they think I am? I don't drop shot. Damn, I have 287 crypto keys. <laughs> That's a lot of crypto keys. I have to say, a lot of the legendary outfits in this game are better than the epic outfits were in the beginning of Black Ops 4. Double Agent RK5 Fast Mag. And Ice for the BRM. I like Ice. It's good. Etching for the Haymaker. Cow, I don't care about that. Shiva suppressor variant. Ooh. <laughs> A Saturn Varix 3 reticle. I don't even know what the Varix 3 is. Is that a sniper? I don't even remember. Don't say I never do you a son. Fate. Firebreak head theme. <laughs> See again, that looks cool. That's way cooler than any of the legendary stuff in Black or epic stuff in Black Ops 4 from the beginning. I'd be excited for the Carver melee weapon if I didn't already have it. That is a cool weapon though. I can't wait to use that. Can't wait cuz I'm going to I'm very close to unlocking Dark Matter in P in Black Ops 4, and then I'm getting Dark Matter here, so I can't wait to use that. That's a really cool weapon. <laughs> Graphic Reaper head theme, and a lizard decal. It's the Geico Gecko. Oh no, they're trying to sell me Geico insurance. Four hundred and twenty crypto keys. That is a lot, and we're still not even close to being done with this. AGB KN44 grip variant. <sighs> I'm still not even sure if I'm gonna post this or if I'm just gonna do this for myself. I'll... If I get a ranged weapon out of this that I don't own like the nail gun or the mp40 or I think that disc gun I'll post it. if not I'll just keep it for myself I mean I'm bound to get something that I don't have with all this stuff That's why you came to me. I mean I have 430 crypto keys the most I've had in like three years Still around? Yeah, I'm still around. Facade, Varix 3. Again, what is the Varix 3? It's gotta be a sniper. Or an assault rifle. I think it might be an assault rifle. That's pretty sweet, right? Fist pump, Seraph boast gesture. Black Ops 2, Recon Reticle. Transgression VMP camo. Uh-oh, the VMP. I have to say, the VMP is more overpowered in Black Ops 4 than it is in this game. I mean, don't get me wrong, the VMP is overpowered in this game. But not nearly as overpowered uh, as it 
is in Black Ops 4. Black Ops 4 VMP is super cheese. Wow, we actually got a calling card that we didn't have. Interesting. I guess Black Black Ops 4 did the supply or the supply drop system better than this. Because in this th these you know this uh big box bundle isn't dupe protected. At least, you know, if you opened up one of the reserve cases in Black Ops 2, the dupe pro or Black Ops 4, the dupe protected ones, you wouldn't get any duplicated gear. But in this, none of these rare supply drops are dupe protected. So all I'm getting is a bunch of dupes. But if they were dupe protected, who knows what kind of new stuff I'd get. I'd probably get all six of the melee weapon or ranged weapons that I want. Headshot, Prophet, Threat, and Gesture, Ash, and Blood, Outrider, Head Theme. Again, that looks pretty sick. For a legendary. De Los Muertos, Head Theme for Outrider. Ooh. That looks pretty good right there. Probably a duplicate, though. Five hundred and seventy-one crypto keys. <laughs> I'm gonna be able to open up another hundred crates. <laughs> Espionage Brecky sus suppressor variant. I like the Brecky. Etching for the dragon. I like it. I don't snipe, but I like it. Tribal tech for profit and KGB for the KN44. Love the KN44. One of the best assault rifles in Black Ops 3. Metal head seraph theme. Looks pretty cool. Triforce. That's not a triforce. They don't know what a triforce is. That is not a triforce. Prestige for the RK5. I like the RK5. Great pistol. Tarantula Reaper head theme. Another VMP camo. done and we have 700 crypto keys <laughs> cliffhanger outrider theme not as cool as the dia los muertos baroque <laughs> firebreak head theme not bad Looks pretty dope. Uh oh, Temple of Artemis. That's from uh, Wonder Woman. I have Spectre theme. I like Spectre in this game, although I think Spectre's better in Black Ops 4. 
I like his katana. Oh, there's that mummy nomad body theme. I already have that because nomad's like my main guy in this game. Love nomad. The claw. <laughs> That's not the claw. You're talking about the claw from uh, Toy Story. The claw. Oh, dude, it's the Gardens of Babylon. That's one of the seven wonders of the ancient world. Look at that. I wonder if that's what this is. Maybe that collection is the seven wonders of the ancient world. I know there's only six, but technically you get six, and then you get a uh, animated one for getting all of them. So maybe the animated one is the seventh wonder of the ancient world. I don't know. Getting a lot of epics, but they're not ranged weapons. It's just etching for the KRM. I mean, how is etching an epic camo? See, that's one thing that Black Ops 3 didn't have that Black Ops 4 did have. Black Ops 4 had reactive camos. And I will say some of the camos in Black Ops 3 are pretty cool. Um, but the reactive camos in Black Ops 4 are superior. And the Mastercrafts. Ooh, Scarab. That's a good theme for Prophet. Again, I like Prophet better in Black Ops 4, although his Tempest in this game is pretty cool too. Neptune ICR stock variant. Pretty much everything I'm getting is a duplicate. That's why I have 830... 856 crypto keys. It's like the most I've ever had. Tyrannosaurus Rex decal. It's not a bad decal. Still don't really care for decals though. Mystic for Outrider. I think I got, already got the head for that. Venom. That's not Venom. That's not Venom. Osiris, Pharaoh, Extended Mag variant. That looks pretty cool. Extended Mag, some mutts have on that weapon. Northwoods M8A7 Quick Draw variant. Like it. I could use one of those myself. Okay. Not getting any of those new ranged weapons that I want. Haptic camo for the ICR. ICR, great weapon in this game. Half pipe for battery and crash for Spectre. Yeah, that looks pretty creepy. He's a crash dummy. Ooh, camo for the Argus. The Argus way better in this game than it is in Black Ops 4. The Black Ops 4 Argus is garbage. <laughs> 953 crypto keys. You gotta be kidding me, man. Ice for the L car. Ice is a pretty nice camo. I like that. That's a good camo. Flash Dance for Outrider. 
and hive for fire break. Skull Splitter. Already have that melee weapon, but it's pretty cool. Again, can't wait to use that. It's like a little scepter stick. Bandito, Man of War, High Caliber. High Caliber, another crutch attachment to have, because the High Cal cheese for headshots. Oh shoot, Chrome? You can have Chrome? What is this? SpongeBob, or SB129 from SpongeBob? Everything's Chrome. Oh, we almost have a thousand. Oh no, it's the... It's whatever that is. The Wendigo. Oh no. I hate Wendigos. They're, they're bad. You never want to meet one of those. They will eat your face. HVK-30. That's a pretty nice assault rifle in this game. Ritual camo. Jet decal. Revenge emblem. Oh, I like that. Especially since there's a katana in this game. You can actually be a ninja if you use Spectre with the katana. Tank calling card. This this will get us over a thousand. Thousand and eighty-three. We're gonna have enough to open another fifty of these. Still no ranged weapons though. We got one ranged weapon, but it was one I already had. And it's like the best shotgun in this whole game. Road kill for Nomad again, best specialist that I in this game. Milky Way calling card and Dog Fighter calling card. We're gonna own like everything in this game eventually. Carnage KRM262 and the Haymaker Haptic Camo. Haptic for the combat knife. I love the combat knife. Meleeing in this game is pretty fun. AGB for KN94 FMJ variant. Beach eleven hundred. Jester Reaper body theme. The last ride? What is that? The Undertaker? That's the Undertaker's finisher in WWE. The last ride! One of the best finishing moves in all of wrestling. Oh, Prestige for the ICR. Prestige is not that... I, I don't understand how Prestige is a, uh epic camo. That's like a legendary camo. Come on, ranged weapon that I don't own. Nope. Just Kuda ice camo. Kuda, good SMG. Probably the second best SMG in this game, besides the uh, XM Cheese. Transgression for the Black Cell. The Black Cell is the first gun I got gold in this game, because of all the UAVs I had to shoot down. Maybe they'll save something for the last crate. 
They're gonna give me a ranged weapon in the last crate. Another melee weapon that I already own. I've gotten four weapons in this. I got the baseball bat, uh, a knife, the carver knife, a like skull crusher scepter, and the Olympia shotgun, all of which I already have. Ugh, if these were dupe protected, I would have had four weapons that I didn't have before. <gasps> I told you I would get something in the last crate. The NX Shadow Claw. That's actually something I don't have. That is worth posting this. I wasn't going to post it if I didn't get anything, but the NX Shadow Claw, it's basically the Black Ops 3 crossbow. You know me if you've seen my Black Ops 4 videos. I love running the crossbow, and that's the crossbow. Now, in this game, you can dual wield the Shadow Claw, which is just insane. Obviously, just like the crossbow in Black Ops 4, the Shadow Claw was nerfed like three times, so it used to be even more overpowered, and it's still overpowered. Best thing to do for the crossbow is run it with Scavenger. That's what I do in Black Ops 4. That's what you can do in Black Ops 3. You gotta run Scavenger on the Shadow Claw, because you're just gonna run out of ammo in three seconds. And I mean, I run Scavenger anyway because it refuels my C4 in this game, so I'm already running Scavenger. Not sure if I dual wield it. It'd probably be better to dual wield it, but I want it to be similar to the crossbow in Black Ops 4. So I don't know. But that's cool. I love that. That means I have five weapons left to get now, including the nail gun and the MP40 and like three other ones that I don't remember but that that's pretty exciting to get the crossbow I can't wait to use that that is such a cheese weapon probably one of the biggest cheese weapons in this game I like it let's get rid of more dupes usually I introduce these videos before I do them I mean, I guess I could say it now before we open up the rest of these with the 1,300 crypto keys that I have. Um, I basically purchased this big box bundle. It has 100 rare supply drops in it. This is Black Ops 3, obviously. Yeah, I don't know why this is here. I just loaded up Black Ops 3 because of nostalgia purposes and I saw this when I went into Black Jack's shop and I was like wait a minute what this is a thing so yeah I got it it expires in three days if you want to check it out I don't know if you would but it's cool I got a ranged weapon that I didn't have which is nice uh, and you know like I said I wasn't sure if I was going to even post this or if I was just going to have it for myself but I mean, getting the Shadow Claw, the Crossbow of Justice, out of the Supply Drops, that is worth anything, dude. Now let's get this Daily Double. Time for the Jeopardy Daily Double. And I get Etching for the Vesper. The Vesper is pretty much the uh, Spitfire from Black Ops 4. Similar. Hit crew for battery. Alright. Ooh, ice for the XM-53, a rocket launcher. And we have 1,300 uh, things left. 1,300 crypto keys. So we could open up... Let's see. Let's do the math here. Got a calculator. 1,313 divided by 30... I can open up 43 more, plus I'm going to get more crypto keys from opening those, so I could probably open another 60. So instead of a big box bundle of 100, I'm getting a big box bundle of like 160. That's pretty good right there. I just wish I could like purchase multiple ones at a time instead of having to do one at a time like this. Whatever. 
There we go. Art of War Seraph body theme. Probably already have it, but I don't care. Let's see if we can get another ranged weapon that I don't own. Like I said, I know of three of them. There's the disc gun that I don't know the name of, the nail gun, and the MP40. Other than that, I don't remember the other two. Uh, I think one of them might actually be the ballistic knives. I don't have the ballistic knives in this game, which is weird. You'd think I would, but I don't. I don't have the ballistic knives, but I can't wait to get them. Because, you know, the ballistic knives is one weapon that has been in every single Black Ops COD. It was in Black Ops 1, it was in Black Ops 2, it was in this game. It's obviously in Black Ops 4, and it's in Black Ops Cold War. As much as I don't like that game, the ballistic knives are in that game. Battery head theme hive. Nice. We've woken the hive. It's a little destiny joke. I heard Dinklebot say that about 900 times when I was on the moon in Destiny 1. And I say Dinklebot because he was originally voiced by Peter Dinklage and then he was replaced by Nolan North, so they changed his name to Northbot. But yeah, his nickname was Dinklebot. Or Dinklespark, I guess. I don't know. Pretty funny. Respect battery taunt. Yeah, again, I can't preview it. I'd love to preview all these gestures that I'm getting, but I can't. You can do that in Black Ops 4. Can't do it here. Haptic for the MR6. I think the MR6 is supposed to be the Cap 40, but I don't know. I don't remember anything about the weapons in this game. Could be the Cap 40. Not sure. Ruins. Look at that. That's straight out of Dark Souls. Stake out PO6 Fast Mag. PO6, I'm pretty sure, is a sniper. I know I said that about the Varix, but I'm more positive that that's a sniper. And see, there it is, the PO6. That's a sniper. Again, I don't really snipe in this game, but since I am going to be unlocking Dark Matter in this game at some point, I am going to have to use that sniper. And camp really hard with my hive pods and C4. Shank. Shank Spectre head theme. Yeah, you about to get shanked. The Spectre has his little knife thing. Not as cool as his katana, but still pretty cool. Harb... Harb... Harbinger? 48 Dredge Grip? I think the 48 Dredge is an LMG. Pretty sure. Hallucination. So you a hallucination. Transgression for the Pharaoh. I don't know how I feel about the Pharaoh. It's it's like a burst fire SMG. I don't know. It's not the greatest SMG in this game. But I think if you had the right attachments on it, it's okay. Northwoods? I think I already had that, or maybe I had a different Northwoods. Ooh, the 48 Dredge again. I think the 48 Dredge is a burst fire LMG, which is kind of strange. It's one thing to have a burst fire like tactical rifle or SMG, but a burst fire LMG? Insane. <laughs> I 
forgot the brass knuckles were a melee weapon in this game. <laughs> you could run around with brass knuckles like your, uh, you know, what was his name? Barney Ross from uh, the, the Expendables. I think it was in either the second Expendables or the first. I think it was the second. He, like, walks into a bar with... Uh, with Lee Christmas, who's played by Jason Statham, and they just have brass knuckles, and they beat the crap out of everybody in the bar. <laughs> it's pretty funny, but there you go. Brass knuckles. You have to be a brave guy to be going into a gunfight with brass knuckles, but you can in this game. I'm surprised they didn't bring that back in Black Ops 4. I'd love to run around with brass knuckles. Prestige for the Man of War. The Man of War is great assault rifle. Great assault rifle. One of the best. The heck? Why would I have that? I'm not wearing that theme. I'm gonna stick with my mummy theme for Nomad. I ain't wearing that. What are you doing to me, Treyarch? Rabid? What is ruin a dog? I thought he was a human being. He's not a dog. Etching. SVG 100. Another sniper. Oh, I hate snipers. Not a fan of the sniper rifle. Hive. Another hive theme. I've gotten like 20 of those. Psychedelic. Why would I wear that? Come on. There's way better uh, Spectre body themes than that. Trust me. Interesting. Ram. Sunshine for the VMP. Look at all these VMP camos. There's so many. Outbreak for firebreak. <laughs> I like that. And mongoose stock variant for the CUDA. Probably already have it. Haptic for the L car. I'm pretty sure I already got that in this video. Pyramid 2. I don't get it. Why would I use that? What's the point? <laughs> I am Ruin. You should get into an argument with the uh, Groot from Guardians of the Galaxy. He can say, I am Ruin. And then Groot can say, I am Groot. And he'd be like, I am Ruin. I am Groot. <laughs> I wonder how long that would go back and forth for. Pretty long, I would think. This group can only say three words. They really gotta teach Groot to speak with more than three words. There you go, Storm. Storm is like the best epic camo in this game. And it's for the best what the one of the best weapons in the game, the VMP. The Virgin Machine Pistol is 402 Thunder calls it. <laughs> oh, his words, not mine. He calls it the Virgin Machine Pistol. I happen to agree with that. War Torn for the L car. God, getting lots of camos for the L car. What is it? Is that like a machine pistol? Oh no, I broke it. I opened so many supply drops that I broke this thing. It doesn't want to do anything now. No. Give me my stuff. Come on, Blackjack. You're hacking me. Don't do it. Give me my stuff. Ah, oh, I opened too many. It can't fit all this stuff. Not so much for that. And stop. 
And stop. Come on. Come on, Blackjack. Don't do this to me. Well, that worked. There. Stupid thing. MMA fighter for battery. TP. Oh, that's pretty cool. Bronze ruin body theme. Now let's see how that's bronze though. It's not really bronze, but okay. Etching for the Gorgon. Gorgon's a pretty good uh, LMG in this game. Purified Firebreak Taunt. I like it. That's a good one. Deadeye Shiva Fast Mag variant. The Shiva is a tactical rifle. It's like basically the Black Ops 3 version of the Augur DMR. Things super OP. War Torn for the XR2. Oh, there you go. XR2 is like a, a burst fire assault rifle. Pretty good. Not my favorite assault rifle, but it's pretty good. Shark fight? Oh no. The sharks are fighting each other. Cut that out. Don't do that. Fish are friends, it's not food. And sharks are also friends, not food. Looks like we got 51 left, and then we got a bunch of dupes to get rid of. Oh, we gotta burn all these dupes. Look at all these dupes. 45 common, 47 rare, 29 legendary, and 14 epic. How many am I gonna get? I'm gonna get like another 500. This could take a while. 174. 256, 344, 414, 496, damn, 556, holy crap, I got a ton more. Why would anyone open a six pack of commons? Never. It's a waste of time. Come on, give me another ranged weapon that I don't own. Please. Storm for the ICR. ICR, great weapon. Oh no. That robot just did a right cross on that other robot and knocked him out. He did an RKO on a robot knockout. Not to be confused with uh, Randy Orton's RKO, which are his initials, apparently. Fractured Reaper Taunt. Oh, I'm getting all these uh, taunts that I probably already own. Alright, we got 400 left. Attack! You guys got a lot of fists. He's multi fish. multi fist man. Either that or it's the animation of his fist moving. Nah, I couldn't be that. Oh, see? Pyramids of Giza, see? Pyramids of Giza is another one of the wonders of the ancient world. So it must be all the wonders of the ancient world. I like that. Etching for the MR6. I like that. And Phantom for Spectre. Spectre's already a phantom, though. That's what a Spectre means. A Spectre is a phantom. So it's kind of redundant to call him a phantom. The same thing. Nice. 
show. Aha. <laughs> Pretty funny gestures in this game. Dip low. Scrum. That's pretty cool. Scrum. But then Kabuki. Respecter. <laughs> that's pretty. That's pretty funny. Ortis Die. Don't know what that means. Oscar Amber. Reflex Reticle. Don't know what that means either. Outlaw Argus Quick Draw variant. Quick Draw, great perk to have on the Outlaw because you need to aim down sight pretty fast with shotguns. Puzzle Reaper Body Theme and All Done Nomad Threaten Gesture. Oh, we're running low again. We haven't gotten another ranged weapon yet. What are we doing? Come on, give me another ranged weapon. Do it. Don't wait until the last crate again, like I know you're gonna. War Child Battery Taunt. And Private School Seraph. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Alright. Alright, we gotta get get rid of more dupes. 23 common, 21 rare, 6 legendary, and 4 epic. I've lost track of how many of these we've opened. Like 170. Alright, we can open even more. Look at that. Keep going. Don't ever stop. Oh great, the LV-8 Basilisk. Another weapon that I already own, Treyarch. I already own that. And it's not even that good of a weapon. Wartorn for the Kuda. That's good. And Spin Cycle Reaper. <laughs> spin Cycle. Like at a washing machine? Why would you do that? Why, why would you spin cycle in a washing machine? Come on. Mayan Nomad Head Theme. And Ayakashi. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Spectre Body Theme. That looks pretty cool. Alright. We can open up two more. Deployment calling card. Etching for the Weevil. Weevil's a pretty good weapon in this game. Alright, let's do more duplicates. Looks like you can open three more. Bushwhacker melee weapon. Another melee weapon I already own. Your dead specter taunt and swindler for the dragon sniper. It's probably the last one I'm going to be able to open. No, hold on. Looks like we can open two more. Look at this. Two more. Fumigate for fire break. And that's it. Unless we get a duplicate. We did. Yes, one more. We could do one more. Come on, ranged weapon. Doesn't look like it's gonna happen. Ah. Oh. Even with duplicates, there's probably not enough. And that's it. Wow, so we got just the NX Shadow Claw 
crossbow justice. That's all we got. But boy, was that fun. Uh, there's still five melee weapons that elude me in this game, and it's going to take a hundred years to get them with this supply drop system. At least in Black Ops 4, you had the pick a weapon bribe, where you could get the weapon for 50 reserve cases. I don't know why they don't do that here. It's pretty easy to do. It. 50,000 score? How'd I get 9,000 score? I haven't played anything. Interesting. Don't know how I got 9,000 score, but I'll take it. Anyway, I guess that'll do it for this. I'm still not sure if I'm going to post this, but I'll at least have it, you know, available in my capture gallery. And if I decide to do it, I'll do it. But uh, if I do end up making this a video and you enjoyed this video and you liked that I got that NX Shadow Claw Crossbow of Justice, I can't wait to use it, then leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new. I know that it's kind of weird for me to be doing a big box bundle opening in a game that's six years old. But I mean, hey, it was available, and I wanted to do it, and I still had five ranged weapons that I wanted to get, and I got one of them in 160 crates. We opened 160, roughly, I don't know how many, but we opened a lot, and got one weapon that I didn't already have. If there were, if those crates were dupe protected, I would have gotten pretty much every weapon that I wanted. Oh well. I, I, before we end this video, let me show you the weapons that I don't have. But here's what I'm missing. I'm missing the MP40. That's this weapon right here. That would be an SMG. I'm missing the nail gun. And I'm missing... Uh, I can't actually remember what this is called. But I'm missing whatever that is. I have every assault rifle, I have every shotgun, I have every LMG, and I have every sniper. And if you go to secondaries, I have every pistol. Uh, marshals are really good. The rift is okay. And these two are pretty good. I have all the launchers, all the melee weapons, including my favorite melee weapon, the katana. And I'm missing two special weapons. The Ballistic Knife, as I said, and the Disc Gun. But we got the Shadow Claw. Look at that. And it even has a knife on it. So self-loading crossbow quietly fires lethal bolts that impale enemies on impact. And you can get an attachment on this thing that doubles as a knife. So you can melee people with the crossbow. Could you imagine if I could melee people with the crossbow in Black Ops 4? How much more overpowered that'd be? Because you know all the times you've seen me in my videos where I'll fire two bolts at somebody and they'll somehow strafe past the bolts and then insta-melt me with their VMP or whatever. If I had the ability to melee them with my crossbow, if it had like a knife on it that you could knife them with, like the uh, strafe pistol, that would be super great. I know it would kind of make it overpowered, but you know, sometimes you got to do stuff in tough situations because they already nerfed the ammo capacity because it used to be the crossbow in Black Ops 4 would fire four uh, rounds of bolts because each time it fires it fires two bolts so you get four bolts that's two bursts of bolts you used to be able to fire four bursts of bolts so they nerfed it by half that's a huge nerf on the crossbow and that's with other nerfs that they put on it too Still overpowered, but less overpowered than it used to be. Not sure how overpowered this weapon is, because I've never used it, because I just unlocked it. But I can't wait to use it, because it's super great. But anyway, that's the weapons I have left. My grind for Dark Matter in this game is nowhere close to it where it is in Black Ops 4. I've got a long way to go. Unfortunately, not too many people play Black Ops 3. But uh, I wish more people did. I know there's other games out there, but Black Ops 3 needs some love, man. It's a great game. It's, un it's underrated. This is a great COD. The only issue I had with it was the advanced movement. But, uh, I mean, 
There's no less advanced movement in this game than there is in Black Ops 4, and Black Ops 4 is supposedly a boots on the ground COD, and there's more people booty sliding and strafing and jumping all over the place in Black Ops 4 than there ever was in this game. So, I think more people should come back and play some Black Ops 3. Or Treyarch can remaster it on the PS5, and that'll get people to come in and do it. Something like that. I don't know, let me know what you think. But I love this game, because I love Nomad. The specialists were way less cheesy in this game. The weapons are pretty good. The maps were great. The streaks went ham. I mean, just take a look at these streaks real quick. You got the Cerberus, which is like the Mantis. You got the Wraith, which just absolutely slaps. You got the Hater, which is the VSAT. And then you got the Wraps, which is pretty much like a 2065 version of the, uh, the K-9 unit. So, I mean, you got some pretty hefty streaks in this game. And they weren't that hard to get. I mean, look at this. The Hellstorm in this game is only an 800 kill streak. In Black Ops 4, it's a 900 kill streak. Or 950, I th or maybe it's 8. I think it's 900. So it's like 100 more. Because I think the Sentry is like 940. But in this game, the Sentry is 850. So it's 100 less for both of these things. And the Cerberus is 900. In Black Ops 4... It's 1100, so that's 200 less points for that, so streaks went ham in this game and were cheaper to get. I mean, this is pretty much what the Mantis is, and this was the Sniper's Nest. So anyway, before I drone on any longer, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll catch you all later.